Hello, Seesaw teachers, it's Angela, and I'm here to walk you through four things you need to know as you approach the end of the school year. This is specifically for those of you that are out there using free Seesaw, so here we go. Step one, archive your free Seesaw class. So here I am in our free Seesaw class. The upper right, our wrench, and then we're gonna scroll all the way down to archive our class. So I'm gonna do that right now so you can actually see this. So I am, it's giving you a warning, making sure you wanna archive your class. So I'm gonna go ahead and archive this class. If I wanna bring that class back, I'm gonna tap on the gear icon and go into account settings. When I scroll all the way to the bottom of my account settings, I see manage archive classes. If I click there, there's my third grade rock stars. I can restore that class. Here we are back in the same class. All right, the second thing I want you to know is that it's really important to make sure that your families have been connected to their child's Seesaw portfolio. So when we go ahead here and talk about step two, if you haven't yet connected your families, I encourage you to watch the first video about connecting family. So families can download their child's work for free. The good news is when you archive your class, an email is automatically sent to your families with all the information they need for how to download their child's content. If you're using our paid service, Seesaw for Schools, families actually have unlimited access to archived content. If you wanna learn more about Seesaw for Schools, just visit our website. Step three, we wanna make sure that you don't make some of the common mistakes that some teachers do at the end of the school year. So listen up, here we go. Tip number three, don't delete or remove students from your class. That is a big problem. Don't turn off family access. And last, don't delete your class, just archive it. And as a reminder, there is no way to recover deleted classes or journals or students. So we really caution you about that. Seesaw teachers, we know there is still lots of learning taking place in your classroom every single day. So we wanna support you with new ideas. So if you want to get some fresh ideas, go ahead and visit our activity library right inside Seesaw. Very soon, when you tap on the green add button as a teacher and browse the activity library, you are gonna see some of these amazing collections. If you have any questions, make sure you visit help.seesaw.me and have a great end of the year.